The first app is HyperKey. It's surprisingly easy to run out of good, unique keyboard shortcuts that do not interfere with other applications and this app allows you to do just that. It adds an extra modifier key to your Mac. You can replace a pretty much useless caps lock key on your keyboard with one that acts as an additional modifier that you can use in all of your apps that have keyboard shortcuts. This replacement key for caps lock acts like the option, shift, command and control keys on your keyboard so you can use it to set up and perform virtually any custom shortcut on any application on your MacBook. IntelliDoc we all have our preference if we hide the dock on Mac or keep it visible at all times. However, this free app introduces a cool middle ground. It hides the dock when it's overlapped by a window. That way, you are able to see and use the dock when you need it without compromising that valuable MacBook screen real estate when you don't. The app also lets you adjust the distance at which the dock starts to hide itself. Meter this handy productivity app lives in your menu bar and it allows you to easily join your upcoming Zoom, Microsoft Teams or Hangouts meetings and call your contacts without having to navigate those apps separately. Little snitch. Did you know that as soon as you are connected to the internet, applications can potentially send whatever they want to wherever they want? Most often, they do this for your benefit. But sometimes, like in the case of tracking software or malware, they don't. And the worst thing is that you can't even notice anything. So this app makes these internet connections visible and puts you back in control. It shows you which websites your apps are accessing and lets you decide whether you want to allow for that connection to happen or not. Solver. This is a notepad calculator app for Mac. It's a notepad that gives instant answers to calculations in your text. You describe your problem in simple, easy to understand words and the app will interpret your sentences and return the calculation results. It really shines when you use it to explore different scenarios and experiment with numbers. You can use words and numbers alongside each other and you almost never encounter an error. All your work is also automatically saved for you so you can reference it later. But the thing is, if you really want to find that one super useful app for Mac, this list isn't really enough on its own. There's actually one more thing you can do to find much more apps that will make your Mac so much easier to use. And that's why you shouldn't ignore this custom playlist that I've put together with over 41 Mac apps that will make your Mac 10 times, maybe even 100 times easier to use.